Hi everyone, it's Camille, and today I'm going to be filming my August favorites. So these are products that I really enjoyed um, over the month of August. Um, none of these are really new products, uh, maybe a couple, but most of them are just old favorites that I rediscovered when I got home. I got home to BC August 2nd, so most of these favorites are stuff that I use while enjoying my last month of summer before school starts. Today is September 3rd. It's my first day of class, back to school. So yeah, these are like my final last of summer favorite products. So, start with the face products. I have quite a bit of face makeup products. First one is a primer, and it is a drugstore primer. And I don't think I've talked about this in favorites before. I think I showed it in the haul. Um, but yeah, it's the Hard Candy Sheer Envy Primer, the Ultra Light Formula. I don't know if this really works for keeping my makeup lasting long, but it really smooths out my skin for foundation. Um, it's really cheap. I think this is like $5 at Walmart. Um, but yeah, I would repurchase it just for like a smoothing out product. Uh, it's not the best primer, but for the price, it will make your foundation go on really nicely. So this is what I'm wearing under my foundation today, and I love it. So yeah, get this at Walmart. Um, next for like foundations, this is actually a powder foundation, but I do use it to set a liquid foundation. If my skin was a little better, I could use this on its own, but for right now, I just use it to set my makeup. It's the Milani Powder Foundation, and this is in the shade 01 Shell, because I'm ultra pale. So this is what it looks like, and it's just a really good powder. Um, it has a mirror, which I like, and yeah, so there's nothing really else to say. It reminds me a lot of Studio Fix by MAC, which used to be my all-time favorite powder foundation. And usually I'll just apply this on my T-zone um, just to really control the oils. Uh, next I have a bronzer. It's, I've talked about this in my, I feel like all my favorites video, but it's Nars Laguna. This was much loved in August. Um, I don't really have much of a tan anymore. I feel like I've gone really pale since I got back from Montreal. Um, but it's a really good powdered bronzer. As you can see, I love this stuff and I use it. I used it today just to kind of give me a bit of a bronze to my face and I absolutely love it. Um, it's my all-time favorite bronzer for a reason. I don't know if I will repurchase this. I usually buy this only in the summer just because like, I try to like, I don't know, like use other cheaper products during the school year where I'm not so tanned, where it doesn't really matter what I wear. But this, during the summer, is just gorgeous. So I really recommend this a lot. It's expensive, though, but it's worth it. And then I have two blushes, and they're both by Max, and they're both, like, pastel colors, or what I call pastel colors. I got a pastel pink. I can open the other one. These are really old, but they're much loved, like everything else in this haul. Or not this haul, this favorite. This one's a pink, and this one's a peach. This one is peaches. And this one's well dressed, and I'm wearing well dressed or well dressed. <laughs> I'm wearing well dressed today, which is just a baby pink. But this one I wore probably more in August, at the beginning, when I was really tan. When I got home from Montreal, I was so tan, so I would wear this with a bit of Laguna, just blended into my cheekbones. And now I've been leaning more towards well dressed, or you can even mix them. I've mixed them during this month, and it's like the prettiest, perfect blush color ever. So yeah, I really like this. And as for finishes goes, I think they're satin, satins, but they're mostly matte. Like, none of these really have shimmer in them, so that's really good, too. Because sometimes I get, I wore Nars' Deep Throat the entire month of July, because that's the only blush I brought when I went to Montreal. So I got really sick of having glitter on my face. So when I got home, these were a lifesaver. Okay, next I have one eye product and one lip product. Very, very easy. Uh, for my eye product, it's definitely been this palette, and it's by Too Faced, and I don't know if they still make this. I really hope they do, so you guys can pick this up. But it's the Glamour to Go palette, and I should have bought this when I went to Montreal instead of my Naked palette, because this is so much smaller, but whatever. And these are the colors. Most of them are pretty neutral. Really nice colors. Perfect for every day. I've been especially loving these two neutrals on the side. Those are the ones I've been wearing like crazy. 
And then there's also this. Okay, first of all, the blush is broken, so yeah, and the lip products have like blush in them, so I don't really use that. But I do love the eyeshadows, so yeah. And for lip product, the lipstick I'm wearing today, I'm going to retouch it actually. It's by MAC. It's the prettiest baby pink color, and it's Hue by MAC. So, during July, it was Angel. That's what I brought. But during August, it's definitely been Hue. So, yeah. Okay, as for perfume, um, my perfume that I've gone to back, once I've... Once I got back home, I went back to using Lily Pulitzer Beach. I really wanted to bring this when I was in Montreal, but the perfume bottle is really big, and it's also a day scent. Like, I wouldn't wear this to go out, but for the day, it's just, oh my goodness. So good. Like, this is my all-time favorite summer perfume, and I probably will wear this throughout September, just because for me, especially, um, what was I going to say? Especially living on the West Coast. September is pretty much like summer for us just because our June weather is really terrible. Same with July actually usually. So um, yeah, September is like our summer. So I probably will still wear this perfume throughout September. So you probably will see this in my September favorites as well, just saying. Um, but it's, it's wonderful. Like I would just say order it. It's on Amazon for like $20 and you will love it. I promise. So yeah. Um, for skincare, um, I bought in my last haul, I think it was, from Sephora, I bought the Josie Baran skincare kit, the travel size, and I've been loving this. Um, I got it maybe mid-August, but ever since then I've been loving it. The cleansing oil, which I use every, every second day I use this, just because I try to switch it up with cheaper products. Um, like I used this last night, last night was my day to use the the cleansing oil and I love it for my face makeup. I do that and then I cleanse my face after. It's kind of like my pre, my pre cleanse. Like you could use this all by itself to take off everything and just you're done. But I like to really deep clean my skin, so I use this just to take off my face makeup. And then the moisturizer with SPF 40. I haven't actually been using this one that much, honestly. It's still I've probably used it twice just because ever since I got this, I've been working every day pretty much every day I've been working and I work in a mall where I'm not going to be outside so and this is SPF 40 so I've been kind of saving the SPF for like you know when it's actually needed <laughs> so I haven't been using this but I from the times that I tried it I really liked it and then the argan oil I use every night since I got it and I what I do is I mix some with my moisturizer for at night like I make like a little potion in my hand and then I just apply it it's wonderful. I will definitely be repurchasing the full size of this. Okay, and then another skincare thing is my Olay Pro X. Love this. Um, it's kind of like a fake Clarisonic. I need to get a new brush head on it, actually, but this is fabulous. Um, it just rotates like that. And I've been using this to wash my face every night in August, pretty much. I've noticed my skin is just looking better and just doing better. So, I blame this and it's wonderful. So, yeah. Um, and it's like $30, so it's much cheaper than Clarisonic. <laughs> and I use this with all my cleansers pretty much. So, it works with any cleanser. Okay, and then I have a pair of hair favorites. And this is by Garnier. And it's the Garnier Fructis Dry Null Reversal Treatment, whatever. I use this like... You're supposed to leave it on your hair. It's kind of like a mask, but I'm lazy, and I just use this as conditioner, and it works perfectly fine. So what I do is I wash my hair with whatever shampoo, and then I take this, I squeeze like a good amount, and it has avocado in it, so it's really nice. And I just probably, I probably put it on like from here down. So on all this hair, I just drench it with this stuff, and then I rinse it out, and it's just been really nourishing for my hair, and I love it. So, yeah. And my hair, I need to get cut, but I'm just too lazy. Well, I'm not too lazy, I just don't want to cut it because I love long hair. Long hair don't care. So, yeah, I've been using this to try to avoid doing the hairdresser. Okay, and then for some random favorites, I'm going to be really quick because this video, I realize, is like almost 10 minutes long. Holy crap. Um, for TV shows, what have I been watching? 
I'm watching Pretty Liars. Oh my goodness. I kind of wanted to film like a reaction video, but I don't even know. It's kind of too late now, I feel like. The episode was like a week ago. But OMG. Crazy Pretty Liars fan. Um, I've been watching the Kardashians a lot. Keeping up with the Kardashians. I absolutely love that show. Um, so keeping up with the Kardashians and Pretty Liars. It's pretty much all I've been watching, honestly. So yeah. And for music, I feel like I have a lot. But Luke Bryan's new CD, oh my god, that's, that is my CD of August. Um, more specifically, I like, we, um, I was going to say we rode in trucks, and then I realized that wasn't even on the CD. That's from, like, his other CD. Cool. Camino, what is wrong with you? Um, but I love Crash My Party, obviously. Just My Kind of Night. Um, or That's My Kind of Night. What the hell is Camino? Come on, come on, use the song in your fashion video. Um, I like Dirt Road Diary, but it's actually my ringtone right now on my phone, and I'm obsessed. And then We Run This Town, and Beer in the Headlights, and I just love that whole CD. I also love Thomas Red. It goes like this. I love Keith Urban, A Little Bit of Everything, Brad Paisley, oh my goodness, I love everyone, Nothing But Summer, Dallas Smith, uh, uh, I don't even know. I just, oh, Florida Georgia Line. I love them lately a lot. And then, oh, I really like Demi Lovato, Made in the USA. And, oh, and Emblem 3, Chloe. That's my song. And One Direction, best song ever. But I'm more of an Emblem 3 fan. They're dear to my heart, so, yeah. I'm going to have to go say that Luke Bryan and Emblem 3, Chloe, are like my songs of the month. Just saying. So, yeah. Dirt Road Diary and Chloe. I love them. So, yeah, that's my favorite. And I'll talk to you all in the next video. Bye.